Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Welcome to 2021 and welcome to my vlog. Um, to be honest, I had a completely different plan as to what I wanted to vlog about. The very first vlog I wanted to post in 2021, but after some contemplation and failing multiple times already, I realized that the best way for me to go ahead with this is to go impromptu and just be myself and not have any expectations and let destiny unfold what I want to cover. But anyway, today I am so excited to vlog because today's gonna be a special day, gold digger. <laughs> because one of my friends is gonna come over and we are going to dive into holistic personal development goodness. I think I'm getting a call. One sec. That's her. Okay. Hi babes, it's Moni Kung Bra Five Kato. It's about five minutes, yeah? Pardon? Yes. That's okay? Yeah, you have I oat milk, right? Okay. Oat milk? No, I don't. You don't? The normal regular I don't milk? Use oat milk. Ah, you mean, do I drink oat milk? Yes. Ah, yes, I drink oat milk, yes. Okay, I wanted to make... I you want to know that I have oat milk in the house. No, no, no. I wanted to make my oat milk special that I always make. <laughs> oh, nice. I hope you like it. <laughs> okay. Bye. I would love it, I'm oh, sure. Yes. Okay, bye. Okay, bye. Okay, bye. Yes, she'll be here in a few minutes. I'm actually making my favorite oat milk drink if you are following me on instagram follow me already if you are not i always post about making my oat milk drink um it's one of my favorite the reason why i switched to oat milk this year is because generally i had dairy milk after educating myself i learned that dairy cloths causes inflammation and isn't just the best and i have been working on my health and i thought i will try to switch to healthier alternatives now that i know better so i'm so excited let me show you what i'm making so i got tuning mugs gold digger gold digger actually my friend who is coming over we both created this product in a sense we made this we sold it so excited so right now i'm gonna let you guys you know fall into so alhamdulillah i hope you enjoyed the mini tutorial so this is the basic drink that i do and actually this drink although might look so simple but it really brings great joy to my soul and i feel it's important that you have to ask yourselves what are certain things that really bring joy and spark up your soul i would like to call these things the little joys of life so after you identify the little joys of life that you want to hold on to one of the things that has been working so greatly for me and i want to share with you here is to link something that you find hard to do something you find yourselves your souls procrastinating you have resistance towards this activity whether it is working out doing a lesson talking to a friend writing important emails that's going to really shift your business or anything for that matter and whenever you find yourself that you are procrastinating doing a particular action that you really want to do but for some reason there is some resistance that keeps coming up one of the reason it could be is because you do not see an immediate benefit or an immediate reward of doing that action for an example when it comes to working out just because you work out for a week doesn't mean you're going to lose all that stubborn belly fat or you are going to have a very high level of stamina. So whenever you have certain actions like this, couple it up with these little treats that spark joy in your life and 
the next time you think about this act that you're procrastinating instead of thinking about oh my god i don't want to do this you think about that little joy that spark that you're going to have like for me i have this kind of lessons that i take with my sister every single day and we are trying to build our consistency muscle and i'm also trying to be more if i can say consistent with the way i show up uh, and for me to do the shadow work and do the journaling and when i find myself being very reluctant i tell myself that when i do that or while i sit to do this i will gift myself a cup of oat milk generally i put it in this sparkly uh tumbler what do you call this i don't know but today i thought i will twin with my friends my friend actually not friends to celebrate the journey we have been together alhamdulillah and that brings me to the second point well i know that this um, video seems to be scattered but i hope you benefit from these little gems i am sharing so the second point I want to share with you is be very, very conscious about the company you surround yourself with. Um, you know, there's a statement, I don't know the exact wording of it, but it goes something along the line of you are the average of the five people you hang out with. So ask yourself, who are the individuals you hang out with? Are they people who are constantly working on their personal growth? or do they sit around and gossip have they become complacent with life or do they still have the drive to get to their next level it's only when you surround yourself with individuals who carry a certain amount of positive energy will you see that energy reflect into your life no matter how invested you may be in your personal development and how consistent you are there are going to be days where you are going to slip there are going to be days where you just don't feel like it sometimes you might even have an existential crisis and essentially this does not mean anything but when you are feeling good and you have been actively nurturing positive environment and a company then they will really help you get back up faster so i'm so excited to hang out with my friend probably when she comes um, and joins me in some time uh, we will shoot something together and have a nice reflection chat and i guess this is much better than i planned you wouldn't believe it i actually have a paper with me where i planned out the script for the first video i wanted to post in 2021 because one of the things that i'm actively working on is being more consistent on youtube because this is something that i'm so passionate about which i will share more in terms of the passion and how i figured it out in the next video which i hope will be the video where i actually speak about what I wrote in the script. Anyway, I'm going to cut this video here. Probably I'll catch you later after my friend comes over. Till then, bye.